Dear Intercom Foundation, Dear Scarlett, I'm happy you have chosen me as the first artist of your Art for Impact exhibition. And as everyone can see, we are a perfect match. I've been doing aerial photography for the past 10 years. Aerial photography freed me from my own ability to just move in a two-dimensional world and allowed me the ultimate freedom to fully explore my creativity, to search for the beautiful colors and the unique patterns, and chase for the perfect composition. When I first started, I was deeply drawn to the natural beauty, the soft curves, the strange shapes, and the vivid colors. But the more I photographed, the more I saw the earth changing below me. The colors and patterns I was photographing had become the bleeding tears and scars of the earth, the indelible mark of mankind's industrial footprint. Over the last decade, I have focused my lens on environmental issues and climate change by highlighting the fragile beauty of nature. The burning of fossil fuels has released such quantity of carbon dioxide and also other greenhouse gases to cause the current episode of global warming. The concentration of CO2 may be the highest in the last 20 million years. The consequences is melting glacier and ice caps, raising sea levels, raging wildfires and extreme weather events, threatening crop crops, homes and lives across the globe. These changes are further exaggerated by mining exploitations of our oceans and lands, and deforestation of our rainforest. The focus of our society has always been higher economic growth. What will it take to steer us into a new way of life? I think intellectually we all get it, and yet we still cannot close the gulf between our knowledge and our daily activities. In trying to close the gaps between cognition and action, we need a different sort of provocation. We need something to stun us out of our inertia. I hope you enjoy this collection of images from some of the most hidden corners of our world. These regions may seem distant, isolated, or even marginal, and yet they are not. Our faiths are entwined so that what we do here affects them, and what happens there affects us. Using my creativity in aerial photography, I wish to encourage more of us into action. We all have the capacity to shape the world that is to come, and the time to do so is now.